Hello, people of the internet, and it's time. Markiplier has just uploaded his Wilford Wharfstash Choose Your Own Adventure project. If you saw my last video talking about all the FNAF news, you'll know that I am so unbelievably excited to play through this. I always love his Choose Your Own Adventures, and dude, when he mixes it with FNAF and Wilford Wharfstash, like that is just the perfect combination. So frankly, I do not want to waste too much time because I want to explore as much as I can in this singular video. And who knows, maybe you guys will want me to come back for more. But right now, thanks for clicking on the video, I am so excited. If you are too, smash the like, subscribe if you're new, and let's hop into it. So, this is the Wharf Stash Automated Interview Automaton. Like I said, I can't wait to hop into it, smash the like, subscribe, and here we go. I'm so excited. Ah, hey, bud! What's up? Well, that's terrifying. Mm -hmm. That's even more terrifying. Marginally better. Uh, worse. Uh, better? Uh, worse. <laughs> worse. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna turn it up a bit. Ah, there we are. Ah! Welcome. Uh, pretend I remember. This is a pretty okay. important message anyway. I would not want to be in the same building as that thing, I tell you me. I don't want anyway, to be- Anyway, thank you, whoever you are, for agreeing to test out the Wolf Stash Automated Interview Automaton, or for short. Let's start <laughs> with some quick calculation. Yeah. All you need to do is sit back, relax, and listen for some numbers. Okay? Ooh, okay. Here we go. Hello? Ah. Now. Ah! Now, what did you hear? Numbers? Good numbers. Keep in mind, I have no idea what you're actually going to say due to the fact that, as I said before, this message is pre recorded. Wow. If you did hear something, now would be the time to speak up. Well. I'm, t I'm telling you right now, I don't think I heard any numbers, it just, it sounded like maybe he was, you know, having a bit of trouble talking. I'm gonna sound, I'm gonna say it sounds like Nightmarish Gargle. Garbage. Garbage. Yeah, whatever I heard, it was not pleasant. Here we go. Oh. Oh. I forgot to mention, please do not say the word nightmare or uh, garbage or nightmare garbage or any combination of those words. Maybe that should not have been an option. It's just a little bit sensitive. A little touchy feeling. My bad, my bad. Really touchy feeling. Well, well, actually, really touchy feeling. Depending on your definition of touchy and feely, it's really gonna. Ah! I see that I may have messed up. Oh. Oh, and that's it? It ends right there? Yeah, so maybe there was numbers then. <laughs> I tell you. What? Sorry? I tell you. I don't know what he's saying there. I'm sure you people can decode it. Also, that jump scare and all the animations so far are god dang amazing. I'm pretty sure Emil Mako is the person who made the model. Dude, mad props to you. You are so amazing. So, apparently, there were some numbers in there. I didn't hear it. That's great. Or bad. Not oh. really sure what you said. But I choose to remain positive and assume that you are still alive. I sure we'll go with that. Well, within acceptable murder parameters, we're one step closer to mass production. The world demands more interviews, and I can't be everywhere at once all the time. Huh. Some of the time, even you might land an interview someday. That'd Maybe. be neat. Probably not. Oh. On to the next test. Awesome. Word is association. The fundamental basis of any good interview is getting the goods out of those stubborn interviewees. True. Why will say a word and you just say back the first thing that pops into your little head? Okay. Simple, right? Sure. Probably. Good luck. Thanks. Oh God. Initializing word association training protocol. Okay. Round one. Okay. <laughs> Hmm, you Please know, respond. you know, when I Sorry, think of, I didn't get that round two. Okay. Please oh. respond. 
Yeah, so I remember like when I was a kid. Response on data. Okay. Increasing aggression. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Funny story. Funny story about that. Oh, <laughs> potato salad. Oh. I win. Maybe not. dearest next to kin, I regret to inform you that your dearly beloved and or most despised has regrettably, but not unexpectedly, become recently deceased in the life of the Oh no. Be comforted in knowledge that their demise was just as likely to be quick and painless as it was slow and agonizing. He's not responding to this voicemail. This number has already been disconnected. <laughs> cool. All right. That's a do it for the death scenario. Now on to uh, the survivors. <gasps> wow! Potato salad! Yeah! But the test has been passed with... Don't know how you figure that out because it's pre-recorded, but... And speaking of flying colors, our next test is about something called... Um, uh, synthetic Ooh. linguistics. Ooh. So but the point is, you can have a good interview if the warrior isn't able to conjure up the right words in the right situations. Right. So our friend is going to fire off some random words, and you just try to spot anything that doesn't make any sense. Cool, right? yeah. Although, I never make sense anyways. It make any sense because all random words. I believe in you! Thanks! Initializing speech training protocol. Okay. Um, Yes. Yeah, of course. No, no, I don't have. It could be. Left. Right. <laughs> what is happening? Up. Huh? Down. Oh. Down. Oh. Basement. Basement. Detected. Basement. Who? Where? What? Did I? That, I. I. Man. Pink. Okay. Pink. Red. Like your mustache. I saw you. Huh? Me. Die. So, how'd it go? I don't know what to think right now. Don't be shy or do. I'm probably not, I'm guessing. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm dead. Kill them? Well, I don't know if they're dead. I'm just asking. Can a man ask if someone's alive or dead? I'm dead! Hello? Are you alive down there? I you died. Shine through the multiverse. Now I'm even bothering. Uh, how can I tell if you're dead? If uh, I don't respond. I'll flip a coin. I'll flip a coin. <laughs> coin flip, okay. Ah. Oh, that's heads. I didn't call it in the air. <laughs> I know. Head is dead? Hi, buddy. So good to see you again, my truest friend. There's still time. There's still time? What? It... I don't know. Okay, so I went back to the previous option, and instead of saying, yeah, I'm dead, I'm now going to say, he said potato salad. Here we oh, go. Potato salad again. Yep. Weird. Must have really stuck in his head when you first said that. I'm guessing. Yeah. I don't know what you said before because, as I said, it's exactly. Important. So how do you know? Well, I think that's all the calibration that needs to be done for now, anyway. Okay. Our systems are most likely nominal at this point, unless I'm speaking to a pile of quivering meat that's been robotically smooshed into the floor. Smoosh. Either way, we're gonna take this bad boy for a spin with a full-on interview. Ah, that doesn't. That uh, uh, I don't know about that one. That doesn't sound good. It's not but there's no reason to wait around for the wire to get bored, so let's keep it nice and limbo while you sit back and get ready yeah, to man. interview your life. Hell yeah, baby, and let's go. Be the last one too. Oh, okay. Have fun! Thanks. My god, here we go again. Hi. Oh no. Oh no. 
Hello! Good evening. Gentlemen, and all other configurations of being. <laughs> My name is Wilfred Wolfstock, and my guest tonight is. We have a great show for you tonight. Okay. First question. Okay. How many? People have you killed? Are we including like Good okay. answer? Second question. Yeah, I So that's like alter ego lore, I'm guessing. Didn't know the gun was. Yep, it is. Loaded. I didn't know. Was it my fault? Oh no. Okay, so and it's it's been a while since I've I've caught myself up on the um the egos but i'm guessing he's probably talking about him and oh god who is it damien the mayor i can't remember which one i'm sure you guys will help me out in the comments but what do i say here they, they're both almost the exact same length oh god i mean i'm gonna do both the options anyways i'm gonna start off with no you can change the past yeah you can tell all the stories you want to tell it won't change what happened you can't Rewrite the past. Damn. If you live in fantasy forever, you'll lose yourself in the story. Damn. Potato salad. <laughs> okay, yeah! Right. Answer. That was a titillating interview. Yeah. Sure, of course. We are out of time. Thank you for joining me tonight. Yeah, of course. Hey, Chief. Oh, the emotions, the passion, oh. the fury. He's just like me, my sweet baby boy. Well, he should be anyway. He's a perfect scan of my noggin, so he better be a chip off the old block. Yeah. You? Oh, what a supporting role. I did such a great job. <laughs> Still not sure if you're alive, but I am grateful whether you've been torn to shreds or are merely drowning in your own tears. Magnificent. Thank and now you. that testing is done, we can finally bring this monstrosity to the main stage. I'm sure you'll be seeing a lot more of the wire soon. Huh. Very, very soon. Oh. Now get out. Ah. And I'm feeling you for any blood you got on my robot. Have a nice day. Ta -ta. See ya. Ta -ta. Oh God, he's still there. Yeah. So I'm guessing the the uh, the choice to put the who killed Markiplier here makes sense because the lore. <laughs> All right. I went back and now I'm gonna pick. Yes, it was his fault. Um, sorry. Oh no. This is so sad. I don't remember who I was. I wish I did. But I am sorry. That's interesting. Potato salad. Huh. I feel like that's very out of character for Wolfstash. interview. Is it gonna be the same thing? I'm guessing it is. Interesting. 
Yeah, I feel like that's very out of character for Wolf Sash to say that he's sorry for what he's done. Because, you know, he's like the insane one, going around with the gun, bang, bang, you know? Yeah, it's the same thing. I'll I'll listen just in case though. <laughs> it was beautiful. We can finally bring this monstrosity to the main stage. I'm sure you'll be seeing a lot more of the wire too. Yeah, man. Very soon. Now get out. I'll go. Yep. And I'm feeling you Who can mark? You got on my robot. On yeah, there it is. Yeah, I feel like, again, it's been a while since I've caught myself up on the lore, but, like, Wolfstash is the one who's going insane, you know? Like, he's out of his mind. And for him to say, I guess this is his robot form, but he did say that it's like a scanned copy of his memories or something. That's very out of character for him to say that he's sorry, so... That's my take on it. So this is like the second option. I think I heard numbers, and now I'm gonna say, but you didn't say anything. I'm guessing I'll probably just end up dying. Response unclear. Yeah. Increasing aggression. And I'm dead. Awesome. What's he gonna say though? <laughs> Was an accident. It was an accident. Okay. What, when you killed that guy? Because he had the loaded gun. He didn't know the gun was loaded. Ooh, boy. I love this. I love that it actually has lore inside of it. Something that I probably should have expected. And I do believe that that is all of the options for this little choose your own adventure. Dude, I love this so much. This is awesome. It's short. It's sweet. But it's so amazing. <laughs> I'm really happy with this. I, I love the lore, too. I, I really should have gone into it expecting some lore of Wolf Stash, which, again, I'm not all too familiar with anymore because it has been a while. So tell me in the comments exactly what it, what's going on. I'm almost positive that there's someone out there who has just like MatPat with the FNAF timeline, the whole Markiplier timeline out there with like Damien and Celeste, I think her name is. Celine, her name is Celine. Yeah, the Mayor, Darkiplier, again, Wolfstash, all those characters I'm not all too familiar with just cause again, it has been a while, but dude, this is so cool. I, I love seeing him embrace this FNAF theme, I guess, and make a big project out of it. It was absolutely incredible. And personally, I do find Wolfstash to be one of the most interesting characters in his lore, so I'm very happy that he chose that character. And overall, just a very exciting project, and I hope that we can see some more projects soon, even if they're not FNAF related. I just freaking love what Mark is doing. So that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching. Go check out the video linked down below. Go choose your own path. Then again, I did get all of them, so. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.